Is that how strong that grip is? That he got no that idea. choke? He tapped fast. Yo, 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 welcome to the channel again. Thank you for your subscription. Thanks for the likes. Thanks for the comments. I really appreciate it. Kamza Chimaev shocked the world uh, last weekend. You know, he really did what he was supposed to do. You know, I knew the first round would be very tough. You know, if you can escape the first round uh, from Kamzat, you know, you, you, it's likely you'll be able to hold up in the fight and win possibly. But, you know, I don't think anybody can actually withstand that first round. He's always very intense in the first round and he's always very, uh, you know, putting pressure on his opponent. I knew once he goes for that takedown, it will be very hard for the opponent to come out. We saw what happened uh, against uh, Kamaru Usman when he held Kamaru Usman down. That first round went to him. So now, Kamza Chimaev is at the top of the world. You know, though he fights once in a year, you know, remember his last fight was October 2023 against Kamaru Usman. Now he's fighting a year later. So, uh, what's next for uh, Kamza Chimaev? Because now, you know, he has regained all his fans that were doubting him. He has regained them back, you know. People were doubting him that this guy, are you sure he's not going to pull out, you know, before the fight? because of his health issues and every other thing that is surrounding him you know i i learned that maybe his son or so uh is undergoing some things maybe surgery or so so those are the factors that might affect him in the fight but you know he proved everybody wrong he submitted robert whitaker you know in the first round and robert whitaker uh, broke his jaw in that process you know it was very it was a very tough one for robert whitaker robert has already broken silence that you know what happened was that his teeth went in not that his jaw was broken his teeth just went in and he will get that fixed but some doctors are saying it's a very complicated thing that it will require some level of surgery so we hope he gets back well soon comes out my now is number three from number 13 to number three that's very good of him you know 10 he, he jumped 10 positions to become number three so now what's next for him now you know people are saying he's the next one for the title shot you know people are saying you know there is no way they will have to they will give sean strickland you know because sean has been waiting for joy course uh to 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 do the rematch in february january or february but now that Kamzat is in the mix, what do you think will happen? Because UFC is all about the business. And they know that Kamzat and Dracos will bring more money. More pay-per-views, more ticket buys and everything. So, you know, uh, some people are saying they don't want to see the rematch between Sean Strickland and Dracos. You know, Sean fans, you know, they say Sean deserves that, that you know uh the first fight was a robbery and everything like that so now what do you think will happen kamza chimaev is in the mix now number three you know undefeated and he has fought tough fighters too you know comes out uh, kamar Usman, um kevin noland gilbert bones uh jingliang macharat you know he has fought a lot of people and you know though he fought you know like he's fighting once in a year now if you check it his last fight was october 2023 this one is october 2024 the 2022 he fought september 11 2022 okay he fought twice in 2022 against bonds and kevin Oland. you know so he's 30 years now as he said and you know once you are getting older once you cross that 30 you have to uh double up on everything you are doing as a fighter you know like you know you, you don't have enough time to waste so what is happening now that sean uh dracos and uh comes out now in the mix what is happening with them uh sean strickland uh broke his silence you know when people are saying what is happening are you going to fight dracos for the next one now that comes out is in the mix sean sean has something to say he said understand one thing i'm next in line it's been said it's been written january february me and joy cost the places are scrapping go back to chechenia that is referring to kamzat and wait a few months wait sorry uae you are not allowed in chechenia 
but hey crypto scams why you wait you know sean strickland i don't know you know he was referring to kamzo chimaev's uh crypto saga i don't really know much about that you know someone said we feel as though the two of you should fight each other i'm not direct cause i'm not come short i won't take a year off after i win don't worry you know i don't know sean strickland i don't know what is happening what will ufc will do now because um the time is getting closer and kamza didn't really take any damage in the fight uh, against uh robert to take so it should be ready to go in january or february before the ramadan so it should be ready to fight again or, or else yeah maybe he has to wait again for one year again so we don't want to wait for that long so if he really needs the belt i think uh, the ufc should actually actually give him the fight against dracos dracos has something to say too Dracos said, feel sorry for Rob. He looked super ready, but this is a fight game. Well done on a good performance, Kamzat. That being said, I can't wait to take you zero. You know, Kamzat is undefeated and, you know, everybody is waiting for someone that will take his zero away. So, do you think Dracos is up to the task to actually take that zero away? You know, it's going to be a very tough fight because uh, Dracos, you know, we know him for his awkward style of fighting. You know, he's very awkward, you know, in the, but he always finds a way to win. That's the problem. He always finds a way to win you, you know. So, you have to get used to his style of fighting. So, now, Kamzat is number three ranked. Uh, there is nobody to fight again, or, or or unless they will maybe they will have to give him Ishola this Sonya to fight. Um, you know, uh, Drew calls the champion, Sean Strickland, number one, Ishola this Sonya, number two, comes out, number three, Robert Decker, number four, Imavo of Karabia, Barajo, Marvin Vettori. There is no one to fight again except he fights. Uh, Australia this now. What I'm suggesting is that UFC should uh do Sean Strickland Israel at this again. You know, the people are saying Israel wasn't hundred percent in that fight. That's why uh Sean Strickland was able to bully him around, you know. Sean Strickland versus Israel and Israel has said he wants his own revenge too. You know, he said he wanted he wants to revenge because he didn't feel all right in that fight. So they should do Sean Israel Kamzat versus Dracos. So you know, I believe that would actually make sense uh, from my own perspective. You know, so the winner of Sean and Israel will fight the winner of Dracos and Kamzat. So you know, you might say, why is Israel getting a title shot again? You know, but you know, he's a pay-per-view star, and uh, UFC is all about the money they don't care about your opinion ufc just want to make money put up the fighters that can actually sell tickets you know sell the pay-per-view you know so that is what they are all about but there are some fights char Borao is already calling out israel adesoya he said they want to fight him uh that you know because he believes uh it's a good matchup for him uh sharabule to call out israel adesoya at the end of his fight you know i think he's out he's now on number 14 new ranking he's now in the top 15 but i believe you know israel is very very far from him he should fight like two people again before two people again before he fights israel like i i will prefer shara and polo costa you know shara bullet versus polo costa will be a very good fight so uh let's go back to kamzat what do you think is next for Kamzat? Who do you want him to fight next? Is it uh, Dracos for the belt? Or is should fight Sean Strickland or Israel Adesanya? Uh, drop your comment. Let's see what you think. Uh, like this video. Share this video. Thanks for watching. See you soon.